So green Kit Kat. <laughs> And welcome to my vlog. So today it is the 9th of January. Me and Cole now just heading off to um, to Tradiga House for a little walk around the park. I might fly my drone, I'm not entirely sure yet. But first things first, we're gonna go and pick up some bread from Tesco. And, uh, and that's pretty much our exciting day so far. Oh, I had a McDonald's last night. It was amazing, but I'm kind of regretting it today. My stomach just feels bigger. <laughs> um, just gonna go myself some porridge oats. Just take while well, taking coal around the park. I should have got a drink. That'd have made more sense. Oh well, I'll just have to go without. Uh, we just arrived here at Stradiga House. It's just gone 25 to 4. 25 to 4? No, 25 to 3. Sorry, can't tell the time. And it's still a bit cold out, so we're nicely wrapped up warm. And um, I just gotta go and pay for the parking first. Okay, so park is paid for, just heading into Stuttgart House now. I wonder if they've got any coffee available, that'd be great. Let's see how it goes. <laughs> So it's just gone 10 past 3 and we're down here at Tradiga House. Everyone, there's a lot of people down here today. I wasn't expecting this many people to come down. Um, so me and Cole have just gone for a little spot by here that's just away from everyone. So you can have a little wander and away from the dogs. They're off their leads, which I get it, but because I used to have a dog myself. But um, it's just when it comes to kids in the park, I think little dogs, not too bad, but not big dogs. They should be on leads. But... That's just my personal opinion, really. <laughs> nice try, though. Go give it a go, aren't you? Okay, so it's too cold, we're gonna head home now. Okay, so me and Cole come back about four o'clock and now it's seven o'clock. I'm just about to start eating. Uh, I'm gonna get myself some food first and I'm gonna get myself a chicken curry and rice and naan bread and then I'm going to be eating this. Japanese candy and snacks. We've had a go at them already, but these loads of good. We've got one. Oh, these, these are lush. They are so good. Uh, the green tea Kit Kat. I'm so excited. This could be lush. Uh, the Kit Kat, I'm not sure about, <laughs> but everything else is pretty good that we've tasted so far. 
but I'll let you know where they are. I'm going to get my curry on the go now, get the dishes done, and then once I've finished my dinner, get cracking on that. <laughs> Oh yeah, a little tip if you didn't know, get a spoon, put it in there, keeps the bubbles on the Prosecco. Well, that's what I've been told. I think it works. Just had my lovely dinner. I'm gonna try. It's a green Kit Kat. Actually green. Doesn't taste like anything. It's like a really bland Kit Kat, like no chocolate taste at all. Boom! Do you want to try this green Kit Kat? <sighs> yeah, so it doesn't taste like anything. Looks like it's just taken all the sweetness out of it. That is a Nestle Mini Matcha Kit Kat. So, yeah. Nothing. Hmm. Oh, I hope you like my tree. Tree? My t shirt. Tree Rex is for Christmas. So I'm going to go for this now. Oh, Umaibo. Umaibo, I think it's called. Ah, oh, this is a beef. Salted beef tongue. I thought, I don't know. It's a bit worrying that's called salted beef town. It's lovely though, it's really nice. It's called a Yaitara fish sticks. Okay, last one now, because my battery and my light is running out. So let's have a look at this one. Nice, low calorie, it just tastes like cardboard. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed that video. And if you want to see any of my other videos in the bottom right hand corner, if you want to watch that as well, that'd be great. And if you want to like, leave a comment on this video, subscribe. And do you want to see me eat some more Japanese snacks? I might order some more actually, they were quite nice. Yeah, but thanks to Lauren for ordering them, they were brilliant. And uh, see you in the next video.